Alright guys, part two of the three-part series. This is more down the waterfront area, the um, uh, airport there, the seaport, planes coming in, going out. Over across the way is North Vancouver, and then a little bit to the west there is West Vancouver, and in front you have all those trees there on those hills those are that's Stanley Park <clears throat> that's where the big ships come in so let's get on with uh, part two and see where it leads us today guys Little bit of sculpture down in the waterfront. Yeah. Right where I want to be. Right you want to be. Oh, yellow dress. And Chuck's going to do a little bit more here on the history of Vancouver. The land titles and I, uh, I'm thinking so a crowd is going to gather around here and great here. felt uncomfortable great then. Gerard Avenue. All of this was nothing but forest for him to clear and start a farm. Oh, no, 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 sorry. I'm getting mixed up. Edit, cut. Yep. <laughs> Cut. Erase. <laughs> land title. Okay, Chuck, the from the top. Shows Mr. Morton's farm, technically farm, or his own settlement, started right here at the corner of Burrard. 550 acres of forest. What Mr. Morton had planned to do, he thought there was clay here. So his idea was to start making brick, clay bricks right here. Instead, he ended up... No so now a few people are starting to gather around. Pig farm, cows, and the rest. Listening to uh, Chuck's speech. Uh, whoops. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Wonder how, what, what you, like when, when there was trees and stuff here, how long ago was that? Uh, 220 some years. Oh, 200 years. Yeah, oh, boy. 230 years. Oh, okay. 1760s. They moved it down here. Some statue, I did not I know what it meant what at all, one's about, even after reading what it was. A couple of ants on there with an egg in it, but that's okay. <laughs> Man, there's an old building between a couple of couple of old you know buildings. What? Uh, one of these buildings is the oldest one in Vancouver. I'm not sure which one. Yeah, he was saying one of those old wow, buildings there, the, the smallest ones, ones in between, one are one of the oldest buildings in Vancouver.
side, I have better light. A few yeah. more statues downtown, more. Yeah, it's, it's Halloween, right? I want to put my pants. Yeah, I have to be on this side. Or I don't. Okay, we got to do some testing, beer t drinking. So, started uh, in uh, Trout Lake, and here we're ending up part way through the afternoon. Uh, gonna have a, ta a beer taste test. Get a couple of flats of beer. That way you can see more, maybe. Over here. Or get a couple of flights of beer. Like, uh, oh, this, that one says reserved. Oh, is it? Well, it's because the, the host is usually meant to take bring it down. Oh, oh, oh. But that's okay. Uh, if you want to grab that seat over here, that's open oh. for you, and I can bring you over some menus. Okay. Good. Yeah. Sure. Cool. Thanks. Oh, yeah. There we go. Mr. Life of Chuck, Chuck himself, and Cheers. Mr. Oh, Nomadic yet. Man Man. We're having a flight of beer at the, what's this place called again? Steamworks Brewery. Steamworks yeah. Brewery. It's pretty good so far. Steamworks yeah. Brewery. I am going to sample Heroica Red Ale, Cranberry Goose, Chase the Light, <laughs> don't go near the light, Wayne. Go You're getting to that age. Don't go near the light. Follow the light. Follow the light. <laughs> and creamsicle IPA. You got the creamsicle? Yeah. Me too. We got similar That's actually. Creamsicle right there. Yeah. Oh. That's the same. So. Without glasses. Are we going to have a... Okay, what's the matter here? The best. I like that. Uh, Gimbal. Gimbal. We're gonna have a toast. Toast. One toast. Okay. What am I drinking? I'm drinking red ale. I'm drinking the uh, heroic red ale. Ah, uh, same. So toast, my friend. Cheers, brother. <laughs> cheers to you guys. Right on. For watching Wayne. Have my no subscribers. No matter, man, man. Have a drink. Cheers. Yeah. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> That's different. It's hoppy. It's hoppy. Now I gotta do cheers. Oh, I'll do cheers <laughs> on the next time. Or I've been to the US. Sometimes you'll see the plate. It's like, Manitoba? Well, what state is that? I, yeah. Which state is that? And they say, <laughs> your money's all the same color. Uh, or the same, I've been, uh, or, I was somewhere, Tennessee or something. And the same thing, they're like, Oh, 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 what state, what state, or what province, or whatever you call it, is Manitoba? I said, oh yeah, that's our. I, I live in Winnipeg. It's north of Minnesota. You mean they have roads north of Minnesota? <laughs> <laughs> Not skidoos or igloos or you live in teepees. I didn't know they had roads up there. <laughs> <laughs> this brings part two to an end, so stay tuned for part three coming up in the next couple of days here, where I'll have all the questions and the answers for you guys. I'm getting whited out. Oh, that's better. Okay, Wayne did the first cheer. I'm doing the second cheer. So, gentlemen are always first, right? And I'm not a gentleman. So all you non-subscribers, <laughs> please do so. Click the little bell. Uh, it doesn't cost you anything to do so. Uh, share, comment. I love the comments. I read them all and I uh, answer them all. And stay tuned for part three where we'll have all the uh, questions and uh, the answers to uh, the questions. See if you've got them right. Comment. Let me know what you think the answers are. Catch you all on the next one, guys. Part three.